Police say a teacher was having sex with one of his Bible study students. Auburn police arrested that instructor on Tuesday. They say he kept up a relationship with the girl for at least a year. Come Force Joe Moreno joins us live with the details on the teacher. He talked with the school's principal. Joel? Uh, Saber and Casey, the principal says Auburn Adventist Academy is going to learn from this betrayal. They've already fired the teacher. Now they are trying to help that young victim who is the focus of so many rumors. Scott Spee's bio page is an eye opener. He talks about his love for children, trains, traveling, and the Bible, and his deep desire to go to heaven. Auburn Adventist Academy pulled the information off its website earlier this week when police arrested Spee's on suspicion of having sex with a student. We were called in for a faculty meeting and just that's from the first time I heard it. School administrators called investigators at the first hint that Spees was in a relationship with a 16-year-old in his Bible studies class. The school described having hearing rumors through other students that there may be a teacher and student having a relationship. The girl told police it started a year ago when she was 15. She left the boarding school for the summer but said the relationship got more intense when the school year resumed. When she returned to the Adventist Academy in the fall, the relationship picked up there. Uh, and that's when uh, the, there began to be a, a sexual relationship. Administrators began to hear the rumors that Spees was taking the girl back to his apartment in Auburn. Police believe he had sex with the girl on at least 15 occasions. Auburn police arrested Spees Tuesday night. The school principal says he fired Spees from his teaching job and asked him how this could happen. He was very remorseful, very remorseful. Auburn Adventist Academy is a boarding school and holds itself to the highest standards. The principal says this betrayal stings deeply, but they're helping the girl and other students cope with the damage done. We are uh, telling them that we are in the business of educating and protecting them and that they need not uh, fear that this is going to be anything but one isolated incident. Now, the principal also says that the school has counselors working with the kids, and it's reviewing its policies to try to keep this from ever happening again. As for Spees, he is behind bars tonight, held on $150,000 bail. Reporting live here in Auburn, Joel Marino, Como 4 News. Thank you, Joel.